What's happening YouTube? T-Trade here. We are back with what might end up being the last episode of our Walking Dead A New Frontier Let's Play. So let's go ahead and get on track, shall we? Um, now, I'm not going to lie to you. I'm going to take the fourth wall and I'm just, I'm going to pull it down and I'm going to wrinkle it up and we'll throw it away for right now. I probably shouldn't have done that. I'm going to need that later. But, um, basically, what happened was I recorded my first two episodes in one day. And after I got done with that second episode, I went, holy shit, I have to know what happens from here. <laughs> so, uh, what happened was I, I shut down recording. And I went and got some food because I was really hungry. <laughs> I was really, really hungry. It had been like 12 hours since I ate. And uh, I'm, I'm, I calmed down. I let, I let everything just kind of leave my system for a minute. And now I'm back. And I'm ready to see what's left for us. If you remember the last episode, um, all of the shit went down. We went through an obstacle course of awful. Uh, the whole Kate Javi thing, uh, finally reared its head for David, and, uh, then David and Javi fought right at, with the, the apocalypse at our wide open door. <laughs> so, that is where we're at right now, the fight. I literally just paused the game, did my things, and, uh, just something that I want to say that upset me a little bit before I get started, I don't want to waste too much more time. But the fact that I sat there through David's, like, beatdown of, like, oh, I love you. Or, like, oh, I love you, brother. You know, whatever, which is fine. I would honestly be the same way with my own brother because we're both adults at this point in our time, in our lives. And I don't really think any of that would be a thing anyway that would happen to us. And um, But what pissed me off was I didn't fight back until he hit Gabe. Which, I think that's a fair point to fight back at that point. And the game was like, oh, you broke your promise to your dad. Mer, what a bad person you are. And that pissed me off. Because if I actually saw my brother legitimately hitting my nephew the way that he did, it's on. Like... Uh, for, for those of you that don't know, my brother is one of the most important people in my life, even though I don't talk to him as often as I used to, uh, just cause, you know, he's got family and whatnot. I've got all this going on. We have two completely different schedules. If I saw him hit my nephew the way he hit Gabe, it'd have been on. So I, that, that pissed me off a little bit, but that notwithstanding, uh, we're going to jump back in here because I'm not going to lie. I want to know what's going to happen. So, here we are, Apocalypse at our doorstep. Let's, let's see what we got. Javi! I'm so nervous right now, and the game is like shitting itself because I just left it here paused. David! Don't do it! No! Oh my god. What the hell is he doing? He actually did it. He literally just took Gabe and... David took him. We can't wait any longer. We have to go help Richmond. I'm getting on that bulldozer. But Gabe... Gabe wanted to go. He did. We all heard it. You're... You're right. Yeah, that's the thing. Is like she's not wrong. I'm going to save Richmond. Someone has to. I'm with you, Javi. We can go after Gabe on that motorcycle, or go help Kate on the bulldozer. Wherever you go, I go. We're out of time. Javi, I'm sorry. I've been here before, more than once. It's not gonna end well for everyone. It's not. You're right. You're absolutely decide. right. Hard to be caught in the middle. I know that. Nah. I can't let Kate go by herself. It's too dangerous. I'm going with Kate to save the city. What about you, Clem? Like I said, I'm with you, Javi. Let's go save Richmond. Then we go after Gabe. Then we go after Gabe. If we don't die first. Yeah. Ooh. Some nice We're gonna drive brand new the AKs just waiting for We're us. We're gonna need these. 
Yeah, I mean, that's the thing, is... David's a twat, we all know that, but... Oh, maybe it was that close to the end, too. <laughs> Damn it, it was that close. Yeah, I mean, David's a twat, and I can't stand him. Gabe really pisses me off a lot. I'm not especially sad to see either character go, but... Gabe had a little bit of redemption. He seen the wrongs that he was making, and but he still. Side. Can you help us get the gate open? Almost didn't recognize you, Jesus. Jesus! I got in contact with my people. I had a. And Jesus, I sure what? I think I'm getting the hang of this. We'll keep the muertos away. Just get me to the gate so I can open it up. I got your back, Javi. Oh, these are semi-autos. Okay. We're almost there. Hop yeah, we the are. Musket, and I'll lift you to the top of the gate. Musket? The thing in the front, the scooper thing, whatever. Get in it. I'll keep them off you. Yeah, that's really convincing. Go into that thing that all the zombies are getting stuck in. Hey, you my bitch. You my bitch. Yeah, get out of here. Get wrecked. Yuck. Can Hobby, the basket! Right. Is, yeah, basket. Is it really called the basket? Yep, those uh were obviously that was always gonna be a thing. I'm, <laughs> I'm tired of jumping and climbing things at this point. <laughs> I'll have it it's open not, in a second. It's not bad enough we had to do it with the helicopter. They couldn't just have an open gate button. Yeah, right? Um Oh I don't I don't fucking know. Forward! Alright, um That one. Did I do it? I did it! Alright! Bingo! Let's get inside and wrangle the walkers together! If we get them in one group, we can lead them right out! That's true! Yeah, you're right! Lead all 17,000 uh, walkers right on out of here. I don't see how that won't go horribly. It'll be perfect, it'll be just like it's drawn up. Everything is gonna come up Millhouse and just wonderfully. Oh man, what even is happening right now? We are taking on the zombie apocalypse with a bulldozer. Yeah! F that guy, and that guy, and that guy! Yeah, this dude, I like him. I like that guy. That is uh, that's a small amount of zombies there. That is not like an Full entire steam zombie. Ahead. We don't even know how much ammo we have. Yeah, all the X's. Hit all the X's. Get out of here. There's too many. Try the other setting. Oh shit. Finally. They're piling up on the thing. The basket. I don't know. <laughs> I think she looked up the word of the, Shit, the word I'm of the day was busket. Here, take over. Let's plug the breach with the damn truck. Uh, can I? I uh, just I just drive straight. I can't control it at all. Oh my god, that's epic. Okay, why am I a professional at this? Like, I was a failed baseball player. Why am I so good at this? Alright, drop it like it's hot, Javi. What are you doing? Down! Or up, I guess. 
Oh, perfect! 10 out of 10! That's it! Let's get out of here! Do we have an do we have an exit? Jesus! Over here! We need to round up these walkers! Head them towards the gate! Welcome back. I thought we were coming back to uh well not to this. What are you talking about? This is exactly how we found That's it. That's all. I'm just glad you didn't give up on us. Real glad. I gave you my word. Javi, we have to go after Gabe. These guys can take care of the rest of the walkers. Go, Javi. I'll help out here. Okay. Let's go, Clem. I'm just supposed to leave Kate? Okay. Like, everything for the last, like... Oh, whatever. Whatever. Everything about this, it's like the last chapter in this one has been our life with Kate. And now we're just leaving Kate in a zombie infested town. Right on. Perfect. Wonderful. She's right, though. We need to get Kate. They did not make it far. Oh, shit! Dude, no! Happen. Gabriel. Oh no. Oh please. No. I I no. Uh, no. I tried to stop him, Javi. That's when we crashed. God damn. David. Fought for me, Javi. Until they. <coughs> but I couldn't. There were so many. I fucked up. After everything you taught me. Oh, it really hurts. Really bad. <coughs> you didn't fuck anything up, buddy. You fought as hard as you could. I'm proud of you. I tried. I really did. I know. Gabe! Holy shit. No! Do me a favor, go on. Gabe, no! Take my cards. What? My playing cards. Grab them. TJJ Euchre. Okay? Okay. Holy shit. Hey, hey, wait. Yeah. Can I have one more hug? Thank. <laughs> of course, you dork. Clem, Clem. Okay. G give me your gun, Javi. <clears throat> I don't want it. Turn into a muerto. I don't know if I can let you do that to yourself. And I can't make you guys do it for me. Just give me the gun. Hurry. Hurry. You, you have to hurry. I, he's asking for it. I'm going to give it to him. Okay, Gabe. Okay. Here you go.
Way to make me fucking care about somebody at the last fucking second. Wow. I gotta say, the game just reached out and hit me right there. God damn. They just tugged on my heartstrings a little bit. Well, a lot of bit. A lot of bit, honestly. I'm glad you helped me, Javi. But I can't stop wondering how things might be different if you hadn't. <laughs> Maybe Gabe wouldn't be with Mariana right now. They deserve better, Javi. Better than us. Gabe. Mariana. They were my responsibility. They're dead because of me. We're all to blame. Not just you. Jesus Christ. Usually the quiet scares me. What about now? There's a lot of work to be done. The herd could come back. Still, though, I feel more calm here than... than I ever did in an old van on streets with no streetlights. It's we crazy how that tone just changed all of a sudden. We earned feeling calm in the quiet. Let's start a family. You and me. A fresh start. Whoa! What do you say? I think it'd be good for us. You're on. Let's start a family. You don't think it's selfish? It's not the safest world outside of Richmond. Or inside it, I mean... truth be told. So long as I got you, I'm not too worried about it. You gotta piece the world back together somehow, you know? We'll be up there before we know it. Better do something worthwhile in the meantime. This took a really odd turn. That took a really odd turn. Okay. I don't know how to feel about that scene. That was really weird. That kind of seemed out of place a little bit. Jesus! Head now? Yes, indeed. We came here to put an end to the raiding. Looks like that's been done. Glad we got it settled. Gotta move on. We could use you around here. Please stay. We got other people depending on us, Javi. Just that's the way fair. it is. I was worried about you, Javi. About who you are inside. You helped save these people, though. That goes a long way for me. Second chances are in short supply these days. That's what this place can be if you let it. Trust me, though, life within walls is a hell of a lot different than life on the road. Don't take shortcuts like Joan. You gotta do the right thing. Yeah, you're right. Always. <clears throat> Good days, and especially bad. Absolutely. The right thing. No matter what. Good to hear. It is... I read people pretty well. Little gift of mine. You're a capable guy, Javi. Change is in the air here. You can lead that change, and I think you should. For the better. God knows this town could use it. You know what? I'm gonna step up. Lead this place in the right direction. Then as far as I'm concerned, Richmond's in much better hands than it was. 
This Be is busy. weird to me. Trouble never stays too far away. Why is this town of people just going to all of a sudden just take the hobby? So you're out of here too, huh? Yeah. It's time. No, Clem! I have to find AJ Javi. Yeah, no, that's I've fair. waited so long. But could you do me one last favor before I leave? What's one last favor? I used to do this for my niece. That's nice of you. She thought I was terrible at it. Got to keep Poor it short. Not your business. I have Just... to see AJ Javi. I have to see that he's okay. I don't blame you. I don't blame you, Clem. Do you think he remembers me? At least a little? Who could forget you, Clem? No one who knew you, I guarantee it. Truth. Yeah, maybe. Everyone told us he was better off. After everything that's happened, I'm starting to think they're right. I don't know if I was a good mom or not. I mean, that baby loved you! I can't stop thinking about before... it. Before... I really wish I could. Did you love him? With all of my heart. And of course you were. That baby was crying when you left. You know. You fucking know it. Gabe told me you used to play baseball. I did. I loved it. He told me you fucked it all up, too. Yep. Sure did. <laughs> well, you survived. I had to. But you loved it. How do you survive that? How? If you really loved it, how? That's what's good about a broken heart. When you're looking at it all broken and shattered on the floor, you figure out the pieces you need versus the ones you liked. If you're ready to move on, that is. If. Oh, Clem. All done. Well, how's it look? Hey, I am bad at this! You know what? I'll grab your hat. <laughs> Remember this team. Your dad ever teach you about baseball? No, not really. Well, you come back, and I'll tell you all about it. It's a deal. If I bring AJ back with me, will you teach him too? Of course. You bet. He belongs with you, Clementine. That is the truth. Bring him back. That's sad. I don't want Clem to go. I don't. I mean, I don't know. I don't know where the, the series is going to take us. I also can't believe like the town is just gonna be like, hey, that guy killed everybody we that was important to us. Let's follow him. Let's follow him to, to the ends of the earth. Is she going unarmed? What the fuck? We couldn't give her a supply bag? Javi, what are you doing? Oh wow. That was uh that was a heck of an ending. And that's that's it. That's it. Our experience with David was heartfelt.
Wait, 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 this time of need, I did, yeah, I kind of did. To be fair, he was making shitty decisions. And at that point in time, I was trying to make sure that other people didn't fall consequence of those decisions. Oh yeah, we got on our shebang bang with Kate. <laughs> that that totally happened. <laughs> that happened. Caring, Gabe. Oh, I wanted so many good things for you, Gabe, and then you made me stop caring. <laughs> oh man. I feel so judged by the decisions that I'm making. I didn't make more problems in, in Prescott. I didn't make that happen. Uh, what else was there? Then you went behind trips back to the junkyard. Yeah, I did do that. I did that. I'm still mad about that. Also, that dude was totally in that episode. That dude fucking popped up. And I, I'm guessing that was a glitch of some kind, but what the hell? Eleanor, yeah. She she was one of the few people that had redeeming qualities to me, honestly. Like, come come the end of this this whole game, the, the people that I cared about were, like, almost exclusively were, like, uh, were just Javi and, and Kate and Clementine. Game... Gabe got me back at the end, but for the most part, man, like, he was, he was a whiny little twat, and anytime he did anything, he whined about it. So it was really hard for me, like, whether it was the right thing or the wrong thing, it just, he always whined about it. So it was really hard for me to get attached to him, but they, they got me at the end because they tugged on my family heartstrings. Uh, despite you not taking her list, she did, she did save us. She did. Uh, we, we told, uh, we, we took care of Lingard because he asked for it. God damn, that's everybody just gone. Except Jesus! Jesus lived. They got, Conrad, Conrad had it coming. Like, honestly. That dude was going to, like, he had his gun at children. For reason, like, for no reason. For reasons that were completely avoidable. So I didn't feel bad about shooting Conrad, honestly. Joan, that bitch can suck it. She's a dick. <laughs> she was like, just flat out. She's a dick. I guess we don't know exactly what happened to Clint. Huh. I wonder if that's gonna come up again. We stood with David on the ledge. Yeah. We had our, our brother bonding moment. Uh, I wonder... Huh. I guess I didn't really think about it being all that different. Huh. Well, so many of those options, like, they just seemed like the same thing to me. Like, under one blanket. So I, I kind of just put it together, like, no matter what thing I said. Like, here. Oh, I didn't even, I didn't even remember denying it being a thing. Huh. But I figured, like, uh, the coming clean and confessing your love, I thought that was, like, basically the same thing. So, that's why I went the route that I did. Uh, I didn't, like I said, I didn't fight back against David until he hit Gabe. That's what set me off. That's what would set me off as a human being. So, that's, that's when I, I struck back on that one. Gabe, Gabe made his decision with this one, so that's why I was like, I'm gonna go get him, but we're gonna do this first. Like, that was, that made sense to me. After the fight with David Clementine teamed up with you and 40... That's weird to me that there are people that she didn't team up with. I wonder what would have happened along the way that that would be a thing. Huh. Your Clementine became a graceful gunslinger. 
enjoyed brief happy days with Kenny and AJ until a terrible accident changed all of their lives. In a short time in New Frontier, Clem showed hope and grace, trusting others but looking for AJ first and foremost, which made sense. When Javi and David fought at the Water Tower, Clem remembered a similar fight long ago at a snow-covered rest stop. Hint, hint, nudge, nudge, wink, wink, say no more. And she carefully placed a shot to stop David's fight. Oh, yeah! Once David left in the truck with Gabe, Clem realized splitting up was unacceptably dangerous. Yeah. I didn't, for whatever reason, it didn't hit me that Clementine stuff hadn't come up yet. But yeah, that's the that's the game. What's this? Oh, it's just Clem being Clem. No big deal. What is this? Aside from her one woman in the apocalypse. I'm gonna find you, AJ. Oh, good! Yay, more Clementine! <laughs> more Clementine! That makes me so happy! Uh, I've already played the crap out of Walking Dead Season 1. And two. So see that was uh that was season three, you guys. That was season three. Uh, like I said, there weren't a whole lot of characters that I especially attached myself to in that uh just not really identifying with people a whole lot, I guess. I don't know. Some of the writing made it kinda hard to attach to them. Uh some of the choices, I don't know. I guess I mean I'm I'm gonna play more of this game like just for myself. So just because I, I want to see where other things left it. Maybe if I ever get into streaming, I'll do the crowd play. Because the crowd play uh, lets people that are watching you make the choices for you. And I think that would be a really fun stream. If I ever get into streaming, that would be a thing that I would absolutely consider. Um, all in all, I think the game was was decent. I don't know if it was as good. Um, I, one's at the top for me. Two was also really good. Uh, I, would, I would probably put it at as the uh, the lesser of the entire series but but I don't think that it's bad by any means like I, I enjoyed myself playing it uh, I thought a lot of the story was pretty well wrote it was it was really well wrote well written uh, it was it was interesting all in all uh, I, I I would enjoy it if if you're just playing or if you're just watching my playthrough of the game uh, I would I would absolutely suggest playing it for yourself. Uh, because there are so many other choices that could have been made that I didn't make that apparently led down very, very different paths. So, uh, yeah, I don't know. It was, it was enjoyable. Uh, I'm not really sure what kind of sidetracked, uh, thing that I'll have coming up for you next, but... Uh, whenever I figure that out, I do have some ideas, but I'm also very okay with listening to your guys' ideas. If you have any, uh, the comment section is more than available. I, suggestions are always welcomed. I will absolutely listen to anything that you guys would be willing to tell me. Uh, but that, for now, is the end of our sidetrack series. And, uh... Hopefully we'll pick up something really soon because as much as I love playing Pokemon games, it's been really fun to be able to step outside of those and play something else that I've been attached to uh, for an extended period of time and bring to you guys like what I what's what's happening in those games. So that's that. Uh, so just a reminder, if you do like what you see here today and you want to see more of it, to smack the like button down below, because if you don't know, your support is always appreciated. Even just watching is great. Um, likes, comments would do wonders, but, you know, just, I, again, I, I appreciate you guys taking the time to watch me blabber on through a series. Uh, I know I didn't talk as much in this one. I, like, I'm doing more talking now than I did for a vast majority of the series. But, um, you know, it's a story-based game. I don't want to talk over story. But, um, 
again, it just I, I appreciate you guys taking the time out of your lives to bring me in and be bring me to be a part of them. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. So just uh, with everything you do, always remember to stay on track. Bye.